Okay, here with the top cut off of the compressor, you can see how it looks when it's more or less assembled. This is a top solid uh, scroll. I lift it up and the other scrolls underneath. And this is the one that moves. This one, try to get you some animation on this thing, but uh, that's it. Here I've taken this part out here. Uh, it fits right up on there. The discharge is the very center of this thing, and you can see this thing right there, that, that kind of half moon uh, spot in there. That's the discharge, the very center of the scroll. And so it comes from the outside around the outside edge and winds around until it comes up through that half moon. This one does not have a uh, discharge valve on this portion of it. I'll show you where that is. Here we're showing the very top of the compressor. This is a discharge valve right here. This is a little spring-loaded valve in there that uh, does not allow the hot gas from the high side to come back in through the scrolls uh, when the unit shuts down. Okay, for what it's worth, I got a little bit of a slow motion here. Uh, it's not real good. I don't have that good a camera for this, but uh, this is it starting up and uh, operating at about 5% normal speed. Okay, and that's this first one on this uh, Copeland scroll. We'll probably do a little more on it. This this one did have a problem, but uh, that's kind of how it works in the different parts.